we decided to bring South Africans together as a united voice against xenophobia. The incidents over the past two weeks has really damaged the image of South Africa. The time has come for South Africans to show unity, to show that we are a rainbow nation and the lead essay vigil here, the Constitutional Court on Constitution Hill, is a symbolic gesture to show the world that we are standing together. We'll be lighting thousands of candles tonight to show that we are against xenophobia and we are saying with one voice, no to xenophobia. My name is Joshua Max Zimmerman and I say no to xenophobia. My name is Shirley and we say no to xenophobia. My name is Kumo and I say no to xenophobia. No to xenophobia. I say no to xenophobia. And I say no to xenophobia. We say no to xenophobia. I said no to xenophobia. And I say no to xenophobia. I say no to xenophobia from the bottom of my heart. I'm going to ask for just a moment of silence in honor of those who died in the xenophobic attacks of the past couple of weeks. And those, of course, who were injured and the families directly and indirectly affected. A moment of silence, please. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, there's a potent symbolism about this gathering here this evening. We call it a silent vigil, but the location is just as important. As you would know, this place represented the worst of our history, and today it represents the best of this democracy, which is our constitution. And I think on the back of that, then, it is important that we are gathered here today to express our shock and disgust at what has happened in our country over the past couple of weeks. We represent millions of South Africans who couldn't be here with us this evening, but who together with us are saying that this is in no way a representation of who we are. As South Africans, we know we are much, much better than this, and we will do everything in our power to influence those around us, to influence those in our families, to spread the word that we look after people, we represent the best in humanity, not what has happened over the past couple of weeks. <laughs>